What makes the hierarchy even more powerful is that each level has views, which show everything below that level. Views are interfaces that you can view your tasks through. You can have multiple views and set each one up to match what you need to see at each point during your work. Here's an overview. The basic task view types are list, board, calendar, Gantt, and box, which does workloads. And each can be further customized. You can even have multiple of one type and customize them differently. New views can be added in the view bar at the top of the page. Okay, first up is list view, where tasks are in a list divided into groups. Columns can be added to show extra information about each task. Board view, sometimes called Kanban, is a visual way of seeing tasks divided into columns where each task is a card. Columns can show the progress through statuses, assignees, priorities, and more. Calendar view is great for scheduling. It plots out tasks on a calendar to easily see start and due dates, overlap and workload. You can choose between a monthly, weekly, or day view. Box view arrange tasks by person, so you can see an overview of each person's workload and progress. Last but not least, Gantt view uses tasks start and due dates to create an interactive Gantt chart that can visualize dependencies. Each view can be set up the way you want. Filtering allows you to only show relevant tasks, and Memo will filter down to tasks assigned to you in one click. Sorting automatically sets the task order, and you can also set the grouping, subtask visibility, and which columns or fields are visible. Some views, like the calendar and board view, have extra settings that you can adjust to make its functionality suit you. Save the view when you're done to keep these settings. Beyond task views are page views. These aren't related to tasks directly, they help you manage work alongside your tasks. For example, doc views can be used for everything from notes to standard operating procedures to public user guides shared with people outside of your ClickUp workspace. You can even have rich formatting such as headings, checklists, and tables, as well as embedded content. Or embed views allow you to display and interact with literally anything that can be embedded, including Google Sheets. Conversation views allow you to have conversations that span more than one task, for example, to discuss processes for an entire list or space. Form view allows you to create and share a form, which, when filled out, will create a new task, populating the details and custom fields with the answers put on the form. All right, now we've covered hierarchy and views, the core structural elements of ClickUp. In the next video, you'll learn about the other features of ClickUp that will make your life easier. See you there.